Greetings, viewers. This is King Echo. Southern Cameroonians. We've been fighting this war against the Library of Cameroon for four years. And our struggle is starting to bear in some new fruits because there is a new rebel group which is now springing from Southern Cameroon, but springing from French Cameroon, from from the far north of Cameroon. That is, this group now is, um, you know, threatening the government. And they are going to fight against the government. They also have that, their own agenda, but their agenda is against the government. Because they have learned that, you know, the only thing to do with a government like La Republic is to not be become more afraid of La Republic de Cameroon, is to become emboldened and face La Republic de Cameroon. So this new group that is, is self style MLC, that is the name, name of the group, and the leader has sent a strong message to the Cameroon government. Uh, I'm, I got this article from uh, Mimi Mefo, and um, one of one thing that she stated is that if care is not taken, it might have a third arm um, conflict to deal with. In other words, this group will be fighting against the government, and the government still has to face Boko Haram, and the government still has to face Southern Cameroon militia or Amazonian militia. But I would say this, the more groups are springing up, being from um, Anglophone or from Southern Cameroon or from the French Cameroon zone to fight against the government of La Republic of Cameroon, it is an excellent thing for Southern Cameroon. That is to say that the people of Cameroon, French Cameroon, are seeing the truth and standing against the regime of Paul Bia. As a matter of fact, the leader stated that, stated um, something about 40, to fight against the 40-year-old regime, or the 40-year-old, 40-year-old regime has chosen to fight against us, and we will fight against it too. So, they, in other words, this group that is fighting against, or that is starting standing up to fight against live public government, will help to boost the momentum. Will help to boost the spirit of Amazonians because, in other words, we are helping French Cameroonians to hatch an idea from us, Amazonians. They have seen how that we have put the effort, the bold effort to fight against the government of Cameroon for four years, and we were still going. And when we started this war, we didn't have guns, you know, bed. And we were not, that our militia was not trained. And still, after four years, we, we're going. So, so this group, which is new rebel group, which is actually from a military, yeah, they are military men. They're, you know, part of the public government. They work under the public government and they have decided to, to fight against the government. Because they have seen what people were not trained in, 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 in war are fighting against a strong militia and keep and then they're still going for four years you know in this video the, um, uh, a man in Cameroon, Cameroonian military guarded by armed men announced that they are a new group seeking the liberation of some of their some of the president's 
some of President Paul Bia's former allies. And so, uh, some of the people that they actually um, asked for the government of the Republic of Cameroon to release uh, starts from Marfa Ham, 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 Hamadou Yaya, Ia Mohammed, and some of the elites from um, the northern region. Because you know this group that is that is standing up to fight against the government of like political Cameroon is from the north, the far north region, and they want their elites that President Paul Bia has imprisoned for so long to be released. And these are some of the demands they have started, but we will see what this militia group is gonna do. For me personally, the more military militia groups are formed within a um, far north to fight against the government, or even north or south east, littoral, you know, all these regions that are in Cameroon, they have to start realize that the government of like Republic Cameroon, which is being controlled by one tribe which doesn't have the interest of the, the people of these other rural regions in Cameroon, should stand up, form their own um, rebel group to fight against um, the government of Cameroon. With the government of Cameroon, which is backed up by France, because fighting the government of Cameroon, in other words, you're fighting against France, Franks that is supposed to be have, you know, Franks that colonized Cameroon and is supposed to have given of, you know, given Cameroon have freedom. But in other words, even the, the freedom, so called freedom that was given to Cameroon, you know, it was trade with certain concessions that the government of Cameroon has to go by you know with francs in order to do business in other words cameroon is not free cameroon is still enslaved and the people of cameroon french or english are still enslaved through france through using the the government of cameroon to enslave the citizens of Cameroon. So fighting the government of Cameroon to destroy the government institution that is in Cameroon is also fighting against France. And this is something that French Africa must do because French Africa is still enslaved to France. You may think that we got um, our liberty, our freedom. We were, you know, colonization is, is over, but it's not necessarily, it's not really over. It just got evolved into another stage. It got, you know, you got neo, we just went from colonization to neo colonization, which still goes on in a whole different form. So the government of Cameroon must be destroyed and it must be destroyed by the people of Cameroon so that they could have control over their government. Paul, President Paul Pierre has been power for over 40 years because of Franks, because Franks wants him there, because Franks benefit from the over 40 years of President Paul Pierre's regime. And since Franks benefit the children of Cameroon, French or English, will suffer. The only way to destroy this curse is to destroy the government of Cameroon. So I want and I hope more militia groups, rebel groups, 
from um, north, south, east, west, and littoral of Cameroon to rise and take over so that the you know so that President Paul Bia and his tribes, tribal people that he has put, will not continue to do business as usual. So the movement of 10 million Nordists, the man said they and they have now gained to achieve their they are now gained to achieve their own aims through the force of violence. You know, people with power will all respect people with power. So long as you know. Cameroonians, French or English, are there begging for the government to do what they can do for themselves. The government will not do that. The government of Cameroon needs to be completely destroyed because it's not working for the interests of the people, but for the interests of few elites and the government of France. That is a problem. That is the problem that Cameroon as a whole as as a whole faces. President Paul Bia's government has prohibited protests. When you protest, you are a terrorist. Now we will protest with arms, says the leader of the new self style MLC. So they're gonna protest with arms. In other words, every region, apart from the central region, every region region in Cameroon must protest with arms. That is a new style of protest. Because if you try to protest in Cameroon would as a normal protest, you'll be arrested, beaten, shot, killed be jailed because protest is banned in Cameroon. So the only way to protest in Cameroon now is to protest with guns. That way when the militia that the government of the like, Republic Cameroon sends to come and kill the people who are protesting, you have your arms to protect yourself. So this is the new form. This is the new way to survive in Cameroon. Ghana did it when um you know, when they go into their own shit, they have men that rose up and, and destroyed the government because the government had no interest for the people. The government of Lipo Cameroon, the government of President Paul Bia does not give a damn about the people. No, well, it doesn't matter if, you know, Francophones don't see that. Some are seeing it, and because they are seeing it, they are rising up with arms they can know they cannot protest without guns so in order for them to protest against the government they need guns they need to become the new rebel and i think in the near future that is exactly what's going to be happening inside cameroon regions will just be rising up and taking over whoever is bold enough whoever is not afraid whoever has the people that support him or her in whatever region can take over that region that way it will make it more difficult for the government of like public cameroon to control over the region because they don't the government of cameroon do not respect the people and in order for the people to get their respect is only through arms because you know, Anglophones, those we call Anglo fools, the French Cameroons called Anglo fools, have decided not to be remain. They've decided we've decided not to remain Anglo fools no more, which is why we have now arms to fight against French Cameroon government. So if some of the French Cameroonians want to uh, take over, take over their power, or take over their rights in their region. The best thing to do now is to get guns, organize yourself, 
and tell President Paul Bia, this region is now controlled over you. That way, those so-called senators, those so-called so -called leaders who work for President Paul Bia would not be able to control the region. And when they cannot control the region, they can't do shit. They become irrelevant. So far north, the new self-star MLC take control of that um, far north. And I hope other regions in Cameroon will learn that the only way to change Cameroon is to be to, is is to gain the power. You can't have a coup in Cameroon. It's useless. But now is to arm yourself against the government and the government will not be able to fight wars all over the region and they will become insignificant. This is King Nature.